Tonight, Eyewitness News investigates as employees contracted by the EDD are speaking out against what they are calling an unproductive workflow. They work for a company that answers phone calls for the EDD regarding tax forms. They tell us they're only able to help about one out of every 10 people that they speak to. As CBS 47's investigative reporter Kara Rutger reports, their stories could explain why so many are struggling to get answers regarding their unemployment claims. That's right, these contractors do not want to go on camera out of fear their jobs could be in jeopardy for coming forward. They are speaking out about the inefficiencies within the EDD call center, telling us they only help about 10% of the people who call them at a time when help is needed for more than 1 million Californians with unemployment claims stuck in the system. EDD is incapable um, of doing what they're, what they're supposed to do. Strong allegations by contractors who answer phones for the Employment Development Department. Calling it an issue is an understatement. According to these contractors, they only help callers with one thing, obtaining their 1099G tax forms. We keep trying to stress to them that, you know, we want to help you, but we're only solely allowed and have access to your information to help with this one thing. Any other problems, they say protocol is to pass them off to another department. We just heard too many people say that they've been hung up on and nobody calls them back after waiting for three hours on the phone. It's just not right. Three hours is on the short end. These screenshots sent in by viewers show four, five, eight hours on the line with the EDD. Yet for those calling into the 1099G department, their wait time. There's a one minute hold time in our department because there's so many of us. They tell us out of every 10 callers, they are only able to help an average of one. The other nine asking for help with claims transferred back into an automated message. And then it's another Russian roulette of, am I going to get disconnected? And if you are disconnected. They don't allow us to make callbacks. And that's, that's the real kicker. You start right back over at the bottom of the queue. They gave us a little bit more training. We could be incredibly useful, but okay. we sit there for hours on end, maybe sometimes, you know, getting calls that we just transfer off. They openly admit their job position is ineffective. Well, I wouldn't say it's efficient or productive at all. They have good jobs. They work full time and get paid $17 an hour to work from home. This has been a blessing to me to be able to make so much money doing nothing. But at the same time, like, what about those people? I feel guilty that I'm even making this money to do nothing. The contractors tell us they do want to help. They asked management for more training. The response is, let's not focus on what we can't do for them. Let's focus on what we can do. We signed up to be customer service to help people, period. I was on unemployment. Before I got this job, I was in the system. I was on unemployment. So she relates to her callers. I'm so excited. I can be in a position to keep people from getting as frustrated as I was. And, and that's not what's happening. People like Angie, Keith, Rosie, Linda, Veronica, Anthony, Ramona, dozens more writing us with nowhere to go with EDD troubles. Words like, I have kids and no money. All I do is sit and worry and cry. I now live out of my car, screaming through the screen for attention to their claims. Screenshots of their accounts show they are eligible for thousands. But payments pending, pending, and pending. They have failed miserably. Similar words spoken by Assemblyman Jim Patterson. They have failed utterly and completely. Over and over. The California State EDD is a rat's nest of incompetence. The contractors tell us local lawmakers are their only hope in seeing reform in the EDD system. These, you know, your local congressional representative for your district may actually be able to help you more than EDD can. They're actually doing EDD's job. We reached out to the EDD for comment on the story. They wrote back saying they received our inquiry and will get back to us. But as of today, we have not heard back. I'm reporting in the studio, Kara Rucker, CBS 47 Eyewitness News.